Galnet News Update, 3rd of January 3307. With the recent Thargoid incursions in the Witchhead and Colsack Nebula, some commanders may need to remind themselves of how the Thargoids go about invading systems. Systems with Thargoid ships in non-human signal sources, as we've been seeing right up until the end of 3306, are known as Thargoid infestations. Systems with Thargoid infestations can, if the number of Thargoids is not kept under control, become subject to Thargoid incursion. During an incursion, at least one starport will be damaged by Thargoids, and anti-Zeno combat zones will start appearing. If enough Thargoids are killed by the next Thursday, the Thargoids will be driven back. If they are not driven back, then for every week the incursion continues, another starport, if there are any, will be damaged by the Thargoids, and stronger types of Thargoid interceptor will start appearing in the system. If the Thargoids are not driven back, the toehold they have in the human-occupied systems will turn into a beachhead, and then the Thargoid invasion can begin in earnest. Other valuable activities include rescuing people from the burning stations and, once the fires have been put out, ferrying materials to restore the damaged starports to working order. If you look at Galnet in your right-hand cockpit display panel, you'll see the current status of systems suffering from Thargoid incursions. The level of incursion starts at massive, but if enough Thargoids are killed, the level will drop to significant, and then to moderate and then to marginal, and then to no Thargoid presence, and that means the system has been saved from Thargoids. If you would like to help with the Anti-Zeno initiative, you may like to join the AXI. If you would like to help with repairing damaged stations, Operation IDA can provide coordination and rides on fleet carriers, but independent commanders are always welcome to contribute whatever they can to both initiatives. Yeah.